Apologies for the handheld. I'm away from the modelling table and the tripods and all of the other stuff. And I can't find the microphone, so the sound might not be as good as normal. This is Car, Truck and Motorcycle Model World, or Model Car, Truck and Motorcycle World. I'm not completely sure. New, new model magazine for, well, like it says, cars, trucks and motorcycles. Um, it's by the company that does Fantasy Figures International and a number of others. They used to do Truck Model World, but it's been rolled into this. This was announced earlier this year, and I subscribed, and it made it to the stands in November. So I'm just going to have a quick look on the inside. I've had a flick through, but I've not really read it. Also, early subscribers, and I'm one of them, get the ICM Model T 1913 Roadster mod uh, kit. Which is cool and sort of makes up the cost of the subscription. So, contents page gives you a taste of what's inside. New product. It's all nicely laid out, all glossy finish. Um, I did send them when they first announced, I did send them some Spinny World products, but that was a long time ago, and uh, sadly they lost them before publication, so I'm not in here. Subscription is £25 for four issues, but you do get the kit. So that kind of makes up for it, and what's the cover price? Six ninety nine is the cover price, so yeah, twenty five pounds for four of them. It's Sunday. I'm not going to do any maths. You work that one out. Uh, so they do, and this is pretty similar to the way their other magazines do their articles: step by step guides with little captions on each photo <coughs> so, I've only built one motorcycle it was nowhere near as detailed as this this would scare me also kind of doesn't interest me so whilst I appreciate the article and everything that goes into it it's of a model I wouldn't make. I will use it for hints on detailing what things that I do make though. So, rather nice beamer. And I guess a hangover from the truck model world. This is a rather impressive build that somebody's made. They've got a few of these through the uh, magazine. Um, look, at basically an unboxing, a magazine version of an unboxing. Another truck, that's a nice looking beastie. Model of Trucky Diecast. Model trucks are oh, there's there's more of these than you realise. They're more popular. Model car die cast. Another build article, building the uh, Revel VW T1. And this is part two of something that started in model truck world. A 
And this is my kind of a build. A little less custom than I'd build it, but my kind of a build. Building a weathered vehicle. I quite like the look of the Renault 4. I should probably get myself one. I haven't got any of the uh, Renault 4 kits. Another motorbike, more my the era that I would model when I get around to making them, but uh, still a racer. I'm not really into the racers. I'm more choppers and boasters of goo myself. And this is an epic one. 124th sale scratch build of a Gynaf, Gynaf, however you pronounce that. Pronounce that. And another one that's obviously carried over from the model truck world, part two of building a Mac remote control truck based on rubber duck from Convoy. Another inbox of uh, Little Airy VW Golf. And another inbox of a bell kit uh, Citroen. These bell kit rally cars do look nice, but me being me, I don't think I'd be building a rally car. And coming in the next issue. So at seven pounds, it may be a bit much to buy it in the news agent so i would recommend like i did i would recommend getting the subscription um biased a bit towards racing vehicles the cars obviously the trucks cover a wider range of subject um i think i'm going to uh, dig into my stash and see if i have something that i can build that might be appropriate so who knows, if you subscribe, you may see an article from me in there sometime in the future.